Oh, man. Oh, man. Keith Thurman trying to be slick. He trying to be slick, man. You hear me? Let's get into it, y'all. What's going on, everybody? This is your boy, Slick50, back with some more news. Man, your boy, Keith Thurman, think he's slick, man. And it was it was so fast. So fast. Oh, my goodness. Just yesterday, on the tube, somebody was, uh, they were at the Fox um, PBC presser for Earl Spence versus Manny Pacquiao. And um, they caught Sean Porter, and Sean Porter said, I had a conversation with Keith Thurman. I was like, hey, you take ooh guys, and I'll take Jamal James. And then we can do whatever after that, right? So I'm sitting back. I'm like, that's interesting, right? You know, and in case y'all don't know, Shine already fought ooh guys already. So I understood why he told Keith to go fight ooh guys, and he will take Jamal James. So I'm like, all right, what are they up to, right? Again, the news comes out, cross the wire. I mean, it can't cross the wire. I wasn't home to get it out and get this out in time. I would have been first, no doubt. You know what I mean? No doubt I would have been first. I'm trying to pull it up now. Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? I think I passed it. Okay, yeah, I passed it. I went too far. Uh, all right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm trying not to say names. All right, word coming from the commission is you got it. You you down this ooh guys. I said it's room no, I know I did will be defending his WBA welterweight championship against Keith Thurman. An undercard of Pacquiao Spence contracts is apparently agreed on, but not signed yet. And that's probably some formalities or something, like say ring size gloves, things like that. So I was like, what? They just, I just saw the conversation or whatnot between, um, you know, Sean saying he, I didn't see the conversation, but Sean had a conversation, said he had a conversation with Keith Thurman. And then this comes out. Oh my God. I was like trying to hurry up, get home, hurry up, get home to do this video so I can hurry up, put it out, where the case may be. But it's kind of out there now. People are speculating, you know what I'm saying? But uh, this is definite. All right. It, the, the contract has already been sent out. Trust me, I'm. Reading from the phone without putting the names out there. You know what I'm saying? But what I'm saying is, <laughs> boy, this is going to make good. So this cannot be an undercard fight. All right. Once this is signed, okay, this cannot be a undercard fight. This has to be like a co-main event. This is going to be spectacular. Given that Keith Thurman has a fought in, what, over two years? That's a lot of ring rest. Then you're going to fight. I can't remember last time Ugas fought, but it wasn't no year ago. So... Hey, <laughs> this is the part that nobody's tripping off of. Earl's been quoted saying that there's no reason for him to fight a Keith Thurman because Thurman wouldn't fight him and all this stuff, right? Now, if Thurman beats Ugas, and you know, oh man, I'm just excited. I'm sorry, y'all. But if he wants to fight Ugas, I mean, Ugas, if he beats Ugas, Keith Thurman can force Earl to fight him, basically. All right? Because he going to want to be undisputed. Same thing goes for uh, Sean, if he actually fight Jamal James. Or they could fight each other. Keith Thurman and Sean could fight each other and again and just, bro, the possibilities. This is what I like. This is what I like. And I know somebody going to bring it up, but where is Terrence? Where is Crawford? He's left out the mix. It's that's a whole nother video, bro. 
that's a whole nother video people i do not know um but at the same time this right here is huge news makes the pay-per-view way more sweeter to buy i want to see keith thurman back in contention i want to see him active you know what i mean and for him to come back and actually get a, a, a shot to get his belt back, that's nice. And then get a shot to fight Earl Spence, that's nice. You know what I'm saying? Or potentially fight Bud. You know, we don't know what's really going on with that. You know, is, did he resign or he didn't resign? Because from what I'm hearing, you know, he fights a payday, then he's already geared up to fight uh, Josh Taylor next year. So, did he sign or didn't? We still waiting on that bit of news. But at the end of the day, yo, Keith Thurman, if you win, boy, the, the, you got two good possible, three good possibilities, three good fights to head up. Um, let me know what y'all think about this. Do you think the Keith Thurman and Ugas fight is worth, worth watching? I think so. I think it's a great addition to the card. I can't wait to find out what else is on this card. If they can make, if this fight, they sign and get past these little formalities, so to speak, as it says, formalities, which was conveyed to me, um, it got to be something small. I don't see why he doesn't jump on this fight. I just don't. But this, I like fast action. Like I said, this was just talked about yesterday. And then the crowd comes across the board today. Boom. This is what I'm talking about. Fighters need to fighters need to fight. You know what I mean? And um, like I said, Keith Thurman said he wouldn't. I mean, um, Earl Spence said he would never fight Keith. Hey, you want to be undisputed? You just might have to. But Keith got to get past Ugas, and Ugas is not to take lightly. He may not be the most most charismatic, but he can box. So we have to see. Like I said, that was uh, the uh, Sean Porter was a lot closer than what people thought. You know, I'm telling you, I, this is going to be a good one. This is going to be a good one, ladies and gentlemen. Don't sleep. Do not sleep. Don't sleep. I'm just telling you, for real, for real. You just got to know. You just got to know, man. So in the comments, let me know. Let me know what you guys think, okay? This your boy Slick Fifty for GMT Boxing in association in association with in the red corner boxing with Polo J. Make sure you hit that sub button on both channels, like I said, and that like button. Catch us over there on Instagram. Boom, focus. Catch us over there Instagram. It's also right here on the screen as well. All right, as well, like I say. In the red corner of boxing. Focus. And that's how we going to do it. All right, y'all. Y'all be easy. More news coming soon. As tomorrow morning, maybe. You never know what's coming across the wire, baby. We up out of here. Deuces. <laughs>